Hi guys, I haven't been vlogging for for a while, so let's go vlog and thrift at the same time. So maybe we should do that. And I don't know, I'm feeling like vlogging today. <laughs> so uh, yeah, let's go. So this is the thrift store we're going today, as usual. Okay, so we're here in the bags as usual. I, tr I thrifted this before and I sold it. see the bags I can see this one already it's very dirty though for $7.99 I don't know if we could clean that There's this Michael Kors, right? $8.99. It's a missing right there, missing. I don't think we're gonna get that because look, it's very worn, so we're gonna pass on this. Ish. Can we get this? Probably not. You don't see it, it's Fendi. Fendi. A lot of things today, $2.99. These ones are fake. Look. We have blue and then there's this one too. Oh, Sorry. I guess see the shoes. We found the all birds here last time. Um, it's blasting again, so we'll vlog in a bit. <sighs> Crazy ladies like following me <laughs> because probably I'm gonna put this down, but it's, I think it's authentic. Um, for six forty nine, I will vlog later. But it looks authentic. That's 
this um, shirt. There's no brand. No brand. But it's $3.49. Celine Paris. Hi guys, so we are here in the garage, but before we get into the house, I'm just gonna do a um, vlog about this. My daughter is so excited about this. So yeah, my daughter find out last night that there is a collab between McDonald's and BTS and it's all over TikTok apparently. I don't have TikTok, you guys. That's why I really don't care about this stuff. But also, um, my Instagram friend Tina also um, insta story about this and OMG my daughter is so excited that it's in Canada okay so yeah I got the BTS meal so the drink I just got the Coke Zero because I think I'm gonna take this from her she's not into soda so I will take this um, BTS meal it comes with 10 piece nuggets I think the only difference is it's it comes with it like chicken nuggets so it's BTS um, packaging sorry I'm opening this up for <laughs> like uh, and then it's the it's the sauce that it's like make it like official BTS they ran out of the other sauce which is the chili something honey chili whatever but they have the Cajun sauce which is this one so yeah so that's it for the BTS meal it comes with the fries which is nothing different uh, from the regular fries so that's what it is and then my I got my son a double cheeseburger because that's what he wants nothing else and yeah that's the meal it comes with the fries but um, they should have like a um, different kind of fries uh, packaging as well but they don't so yeah the BTS meal here in Canada is $11.49 wow wow it comes with um, 10 piece chicken nuggets and two Cajun sauce or the sauce they ran out of the other one and yeah a drink so yeah, $11.50 for that so yeah let's go inside because I think I texted my my daughter and she's very excited for this so I just decided to do a sit down haul video um, I was gonna do a non formal vlog style um, showing you guys what I got today from the thrift store but I remembered I went to the thrift store yesterday at Salvation Army and yeah I have enough stuff to show you guys because sometimes I hate doing haul video I only gonna show you guys what three to four items and I'm like oh well but uh, yeah I guess I have enough stuff so yeah I went to Salvation Army yesterday so uh, I put it in my kind of like um, mesh uh, reusable market tote bag so yeah um, okay so I got these uh, puzzle kind of game it's called top spin by binary arts so i was playing with it last night and i was getting into it actually so basically you have to put uh, all the numbers in order and then this um part over here spins out spins out like that so and then all the numbers are you know like moves like that all the way around and this is good for like um puzzles is always good for your brain and uh, yeah this is one of them like I can't wait to um, my daughter or my son will play with this it, this is actually a good for kids and not a kid like me it's good too and the price is 99 cents so yeah from Salvation Army and yeah I like this game can't wait to um, solve the numbers in order so yeah and I got this I know I told you guys that I will never pick up any coach wristlet but this one is in good condition in this color um, it's missing hang tag but it's one of these bigger wristlet it's not the small small ones put it like that or a wristlet so 
yeah it's a really nice kind of um, subtle orange color and it's missing uh, one of those coach hang tags but it's okay and it's $6.99 for this I think that's a good price and yeah inside is just like a like the same color as the trim and oh inside it I put it here because I don't want to uh, break because they're breakable item um, it's a salt and pepper shakers but look at this this oh it's so cute they are like cats <laughs> they're like cats yeah salt and pepper shakers and they're 99 cents for for you know the set okay next um, here is a bag um, I don't know where the tag uh, probably it fell um, okay so this is like a thicker um, crossbody like the strap but it looks like this it's suede on the front and kind of like patent leather um, throughout and also the strap is like that half um, suede and half patent and also there is a uh, belt loop so you could loop it on your belt and it become like a belt bag oh I forgot to tell you guys what is this bag it's actually anthropology anthropology I paid $6.99 as well for this it was beside this coach um, wristlet and yeah um, strap is not adjustable so whatever the length is this um, strap it's like that but I mean it's really cute like yeah or you could use it like that higher up like that it's cute so yeah for anthropology bag they're quite expensive sometimes but they go on sale so that's that and last bag that I got from Salvation Army is this leather um, it's like brown leather first it's um, roots it's vintage it has some like wear on the leather but it's very nice leather I know the vintage leather uh, roots are very durable and here you go I paid up a little bit more for this $12.99 so this bag you can you can uh, use as a crossbody bag if it's long long for you or just a shoulder bag it's fine so it's like a slouchy kind of throw around bag it's really nice for every day it fits a lot because it's kind of like bucket bucket bag and hobo bag at the same time has a pocket on the side just one pocket on the side um, right here great for your keys and whatnot easy access there's like dry patches right there but other than that it's still in good condition like I mean yeah the inside is very clean like that very clean so I paid up but I mean it's worth it for $12.99 maybe I could get like around uh, I don't know $40 off Poshmark or something like that so moving on to what we got from Value Village today I recycled this um, paper bag to redonate some of the items here and there here at home so um, okay let's start I have like a couple clothing items um, so we gotta go through with that I got these kind of like jumpsuit wide leg I'll insert a picture here if I could find like similar one because it's kind of hard to show you guys right now like this but um, it has like this tie on the shoulder it's really nice I've been looking around for something like this it feels like it's linen but it's not it's actually cotton and polyester together so yeah and it's brand new with tags brand new with tags um, I don't know about this brand but I don't care about the brand anyways but 
so next item is this shirt there's no label there's no tag so I don't even know um, if this is just a printed um, like a normal shirt that they printed something on but I don't care but it says Celine Paris this shirt is nice to pair it up with like shorts like jean shorts or rip jeans or just jeans <laughs> like normal jeans so yeah it's nice uh, Celine uh, Paris um, yeah, and this one is only three forty nine. Oh, the jumpsuit is actually twelve fifty, um, but I use like the twenty percent off coupon with everything, so yeah, still alright. So Celine Paris like that, and then I got um these sandals. Um, they are so in right now. One of these like daddy sandals. They call it daddy sandals <laughs> um, but these are women's Nike um, sandals um, has like a big Nike um, logo there it's $6.99 I'm surprised they didn't price this up because you know like it's so nice and this is size US 7 so that's nice and it's really good condition still up oh, crap Good condition still like it needs wiping but yeah look at that it's still good condition so for $6.99 that's a good deal for size 7 if you're size 7 that's a nice um, sandals summer sandals and then I'm saving uh, the best for last <laughs> I got these lululemon headband this one is different though I told myself I'm not, never gonna pick up any of these lululemon headband because it doesn't stay in my hair anyways um, but this one though is kind of different because I don't know the style is um, it's a bit thicker and it has a loop actually if your hair is up and you have a ponytail you could just loop it over here and I guess it will stay in your head more and also there's no oh there's no but it looks like it's like two headband in one so that's kind of weird but we'll see I'll try it if not then I'll just gather all my headbands and lot it together and post um, post them on my Poshmark I don't know but yeah I never really use this at all I only use one uh, when I wash my face and I have to um, put headband on my hair so it won't get wet so yeah, this one is $3.99. Oh, I used 20% off coupon if I didn't mention that already. So yeah, I used 20% off coupon. Okay, so the last item is the find of the day. So you see the vlog, I picked up this uh, Fendi, um, but it's like pochette. I'm gonna, just gonna say it, pochette. Um, I think it's real. I think it is real <laughs> because of a few reasons that I think it's real. <laughs> But it, there's a funny story about this bag. I was holding this bag already and there's this uh, older lady who was just hovering me and probably um, thinking like, oh, maybe I will put this bag down if because I put down a lot of bags, okay? Um, I was vlogging too, like you've seen like in the vlog that I was vlogging the fake coach bags and fake um, Louis Vuitton even so maybe she thinks that I'm gonna put this bag but I didn't put it back <laughs> because I know I know that um, I, I know I know the feeling that this is real that I picked up this bag and that I know that it's real uh, first of all it's 649 like come on now but uh, okay so I know the bag is real um, there's this um, label here, tag, made in Italy, okay. Um, there is like a, kind of like a staining there, but I'm gonna see if I could remove that. Um, the inside has like Fendi wordings on it, faint, but I don't know if you could, you guys could see that. That's one, one of the things I see. And also, um, there is, serial number printed it's very faint but it's still there you can still see it from there 
and all the hardwares are marked Fendi right there I don't know my lighting sucks sorry guys um, right there too on the side um, the handle is a bit warped but it's still in okay condition there's some separating going on but we could fix that um, yeah like this part over here is separating but we could get it like a um, we could get a what do you call it leather glue there you go leather glue Um, very inexpensive to fix this leather glue and also um, the zipper pull is kind of like um, like not tarnished but um, not rubbed off but it's fading like I mean the color is fading but you can still see the Fendi I also check underneath the zipper if there is like a double F underneath underneath it usually it it has F on it and there is you guys right there right there F so those are the um, reasons why I think it is real and also um, the bag itself um, it's still in good shape um, like underneath no holes whatever and the Fendi is upside down like that which is it is like that in in the Fendi the original Fendi authentic Fendi so yeah. so this is a good find of the day it's so in right now like Fendi all this um, logos like that it's very very on trend so I think I'm gonna use it uh, for a little bit and then I'm gonna let it go slowly I'm gonna let it go slowly <laughs> um, so yeah yeah so that's everything of what I thrifted yesterday and today and I hope you guys enjoyed um, this uh, thrifting vlog thrifting haul and oh today you guys it's anniversary of Poshmark Canada year two two years old here in Canada and I've been on and off um, Poshmark um, seller but now I'm full-time uh, reseller um, Poshmark so yeah I will be jumping on it later because I I reserved my tickets for their virtual um, event so yeah and I hope I'm gonna upload this today as well so <laughs> crossing fingers that I will I have so much things uh, on my plate and I just don't know which one to do first and uh, yeah that's it guys I hope you guys um, have a lovely day even though what it, what it's today Thursday happy Thursday guys <laughs> uh, I hope you guys have a lovely Thursday so yeah thank you guys for watching and yeah see you guys on my next video bye guys